Hey guys, Miles here with the Electric Bike Lab, affordablebikes.ca. We're gonna be looking at these eco packs. Uh, if you followed our website or followed our stuff, uh, we have these uh, low cost bicycle uh, batteries that came out of scooters. Uh, I believe they're called the R5 battery, but these have LG MH1 cells. They're a 36 volt, 12.8 amp hour. We offer them in an as is battery as well as a refurbished battery. This is a look at the refurbished battery. This one needs a BMS swap. Um, the refurbished ones, we do an XT60. We swap the BMS inside and we put a charge port. But in as is form, they look something like this. So I've taken the cap off of this one already. But when that pops back on, it's gonna look something like this. And underneath the hood, it's gonna look like this with this circuit board on top. And if we peel that circuit board off, it's gonna look like this. So we've got 40 of these cells. LG MH1 cells are 3200 milliamp hour capacity, 10 amps discharge, which allows this pack to do about 40 amps. And so for a 36 volt battery, that's about 1500 to 1600 watts. But you can see that these cells are laid out in a honeycomb structure, which means they're really tightly pressed up uh, to one another, yet quite safely built with these very sturdy cell holders, uh, this nice nickel that is uh, welded really securely. And as you can see, if you bunch, bunch, if you bunch a bunch of them up together, um, you can combine them uh, to make a different style of pack. So let's take a look at this. This here is a 72 volt battery. Uh, it has six of these packs together. So we got three here in parallel and then two of them in series that are connected by wires. And so this is a 72 volt, 38 amp hour battery, which is pretty big, 1500 watts a pack. So that's 1500. Uh, 3,400, 9,000 watts peak that uh, a battery like that could do. Um, so one thing I wanted to show you is how to pop these off. So there are all these screws that are normally in here. They're Phillips screws. And what I would normally do is put the battery into a vise, um, squeeze the vise, and then take a hammer and smack those tabs up. So eventually, it does take quite a bit of force, um, but eventually that will pop free, and then you can open up the pack like that, and it's gonna be exposed. And then if you wanna pull this out completely, there's four Phillips screws that are in here. You can just put like an impact gun. As you can see that came out. So you got four of those. And then underneath here, there's a place where you will put a pry bar, pry and the pack will lift up. And that's how these come apart. But yeah, these are a really solid pack um, and very inexpensive. So we have these on our site, but you can also find these at a place like Battery Clearing House, uh, JAG 3.5. Um, yeah, they are everywhere. These were in electric scooters. And yeah, these are the ones that we've used. We've uh, yeah had really good luck with them. They seem to have a lot of life in them. And yeah, they can be very compact, very practical. So hope you like this video. And until next time, we'll see you soon.